Hi. After watching the hacking barcodes video, uh, which is actually the talk given by FX in DefCon 16, I decided to actually check how easy it would be to generate barcodes and read barcodes using software. So in this video, we will look at two very simple software uh, which are available for download using which it is possible to generate your own barcodes as well as read barcodes which can be scanned uh, or else which are in the form of images on the web. So let's begin with our demo. So in order to generate a barcode, we are using a software called Barcode Wizard from VSIS software. So it's very, very simple to use. Enter the text uh, you need to create. So let's say this is a secret. And if you notice the corresponding barcode has been created. So let's go ahead, copy this barcode to clipboard. Now let's go ahead and bring up our image processing software. So let's use Irfan view and let's go ahead and store the barcode in barcode.jpg. So overridden. Now what we use is a software called image reader from Softech barcode. So we can now open the file barcode.jpg. As we notice, the file has been loaded and this is the same barcode which we generated with the barcode wizard. And then all we need to do is click on read. If you notice, it has decoded the barcode and says this is a secret and the type of barcoding used is code 39. And the same is applicable here. So well, that's all. It's a very simple video in which what I wanted to demonstrate is how simple is it to actually generate a barcode and go ahead and read a barcode. And if you've already seen FX's talk, uh, which is the hacking barcodes video, then you would understand what are the other interesting things one can actually do if he has the barcode reader as well as a barcode writer in place. So quickly to kind of uh, take this to conclusion, you can actually go ahead and play around uh, with a lot of barcodes using images.google. If you just go ahead and type in barcodes, you would actually get a lot of barcodes. You can download these images, save them and go ahead and use the uh, image reader to actually see if you can decipher them. Another interesting thing could be to use uh, something like airline boarding passes in the search. And if you notice, we get to see a lot of airline boarding passes. Uh, some of them are probably bogus passes, some of them real ones, which you can actually use to try and test out uh, the software and see if you can find something interesting. I would actually encourage you to go and have a look at FX's talk, which is available on securitytube.net. Uh, called Hacking Barcodes. So this talk will give you a lot of more information on what interesting things one can do uh, once he has a barcode reader as well as a writer in place. That's all for this video. Thank you.